see it. <laughs> see. Lapakini Lapa Lachifa, yeah. Lachifa is exactly the word I'd like to hear you say again. Lachifa. One more time, sorry. Hachi. Hachi. And how would you say I said it? Hachili. And one more time? Hachili. And if you say about somebody, he says it and says it, and keeps saying it, I think it's a word like Ahanchi. Well, uh, at, uh, It wouldn't be repeating it over and over right at the time, but you know, every time you see him, right. if he said over, you know, like that, now that would say, Auntie. Yeah, every time you see him, yeah, I'd say that. Uh, Auntie, say yeah, Auntie. Auntie. It be. It be. How would you ask somebody about, did she kill it? I beat them. I wish you did. Yeah, I beat them. Well, I'm sure Kathy was. No, no reference to stand up to me. Um, how would I say did she kill it? Snako chimambi tok. Can you just say chimambi? That wouldn't be the whole thing. I mean, not the way you ask the question you asked me. It wouldn't mean that, but they. Shimambi is big. Uh, kind of like, that would be kind of beating you in a game of something, checkers or something. Okay. That's not killing the... Okay. Can you uh, say that Shimambi again? Shimambi. And one more time? Shimambi. Okay, so that's like beating you in a game. Yeah, beating you in checkers or dominoes or something. Or a ball game or anything, any game in sports or something that's beating you in something. You kill me. <laughs> you have to keep saying that. I'd, say I'd do it again. <laughs> huh? You kill me. You sabi Okay, one more time. You sabi. Sabi You killed me. You know, you killed me. Sabi. And so if you ki you killed me, you uh, sabi She be little. One more time. She be little. Okay, great. And um, if I come to your house and I knock on the door and I say, I'm here, how do I say that? Alali. One more time. Alali. And I brought something with me. How would I say, I brought it here? Stalali. One more time. Stalali. He didn't come. How would you say? He Igloo. One more time. Igloo. Okay. What's the word for early? Chico. Chiki. Cheeky. And then we talked about this other word. Um, people have trouble telling me exactly what it means. Achiba. Achiba. That's a that's a slang. I'll tell you that before it starts. And they're just uh, uh, like uh, you get aggravated. Okay. You know, like somebody does something or the kids uh, won't behave. Yeah, and they say Achiba. And they just say, Oh, it's, you're a lot of nuisance, or. Because they get on my nerves, or anything. it fits a lot of ways, but it's uh, that's more of a slang. It's Could you say that word again? What? What is it? Al One more time. Al Okay. And then we talked about if you've got a dog out there that you tied maybe up to one of these cars that's sitting out there, tied it to the bumper or something like that, um, tying it to something, acetali? Yeah. Could you say that word again? One more time. Acetali. Ilya. One more time. Ilya. And then we talked about this word for um, somebody, you know, all excited, anticipating something that's coming up. Ayimita. Ayimita, uh, yeah, enjoying something, yeah. Enjoying it. Yeah. Okay. Um, would you say that? Ayimita. And one more time. Ayimita. Okay. What's the word for melting? Bila. One more time. Bila. 
Imbishlichi. Imbishlichi. That's towards it. Uh, in there, in there, in there. Imbishafchi, yeah, that would be. Imbishafchi. Imbishafchi. Okay, good. Now, if somebody has something in their arms, like maybe they're carrying a baby or something, and they lay it down on the bed or something like that, what's the word for laying it down? Bully. One more time? Bully. And if you've got several of them, I don't know if I have several babies here, but maybe several dogs or something, and I lay them down, what's the word for that? That wouldn't be that way of putting babies down. No. Kali is like laying logs in the road. Well, I said it could be logs. Yeah. In the road, you know, it's kind of skip oh, okay. here and there. Kind of skip. Yeah. Could you say that word again? Kali. Okay, one more time. Kali. Okay. So it's like the Indians used to use them, them logs, you know, and them bottom get so muddy. Yeah. They'd put log road there instead of, and they didn't have no concrete. Chaha. One more time. Chaha. And how would you say I'm tall? So chaha. One more time. So chaha. And could you tell me the word for sticky? Hmm, ch sticky. Chakisa. One more time. Chakisa. And how would you say I am sticky? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe somebody poured a bottle of syrup all over me. So chakisa, I guess. Yeah. One more time. So chakisa. Yeah. Um, I think you said something like chikibi. Yeah. Chikibi. 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 Would you say that again? Chikibi. Okay, great. And I think we talked about this word for when uh, Indian ladies used to have a fight and pull hair. Chikoli. Uh, Chikofi. Okay. Could you say that one again? Chikofi. Okay. And if I wanted to say um, she's doing that to me, can I say sachikofi? Mm hmm. That means she pulled my hair. She pulled my hair. Yeah, that's, uh, that's when they're mad. Head. See, when they're mad. Can you say that? Sachikofi? Sachikofi, yeah, I guess. Uh, One more time. Sachikofi. Okay. Um, what's the word for clean? Chufata. One more time. Chufata. And I am clean? Sachufata. One more time. Sachufata. Okay. Um, how do you say it's really good? Chugma. <laughs> and hold that vowel. See, the longer you hold it, the better it is. Chugma. <laughs> okay. um, how would you say um, he's playing? He's playing ball, I don't know. Oh, Chukoshkomo. One more time. Chukoshkomo. And if I wanted to say he's making me play, can I say. Uh, I guess you could. I guess you could say that. Uh, it don't. Say that? It don't hardly fit. Uh, I don't see a proper place to use that. But I think most people feel it's a kind of funny word. It is. I mean, uh, see, we got different ways of. Expressing things like that so in a different way, and and uh, you don't have to use that uh, uh, that one word for everything to to describe something like that. My you know. purpose in asking you to say this word doesn't really relate to the expression; it's just the sound. So you'd make me happy if you could say "sachokoshkomochi." If, if that's what if you want me to say it, why? Sachokoshkomochi. Sachukos Komochi. One more time. Sachukos Komochi. Great. The first one wasn't too good, but I love the second two. Then we talked next week about this word for things getting given away, like presents, called Bena. Something is given. I know 
you told me you wouldn't say that about something like commodities because they have to give those to people. Yeah, right. I give to uh, Habina is uh, right. being given to you. If you were talking about the thing that is given, could you say Habina? No, uh, nah, I wouldn't. Not me. But. Does that word Habina mean anything to you? Yeah, it could fit in there some way in that same line of deal, but uh, Habina is uh, okay. given as a. Uh, Gift to you, you know, and you're getting right. a gift. I mean, uh, is there to me, uh, that might be just a slang, Pam. Uh, I don't know. Oh, uh, that's what I learned. See, I mean, that's the way I I'm talking my my dialect. Uh, is a perfectly great word. It's just yeah. Today, for our purposes, I would like to record the word Hobana. And I don't know exactly what it means. Uh, yeah, I don't either. It's, it's not really a gift. Okay. But does it mean something? Hobana? Hobana. Hobana is a. Uh, it's seems to me like. Staying all night to me. Camping out, yeah. Holbina sounds like staying all night. Uh, camping out or something like that. Uh, could you say that again? Holbina. Okay, could you say it again? Holbina. No, I'll write down camping out. I don't know about that. Anyway, you said the word. Yeah. <laughs> um, how do you tell somebody, listen? Hagla. One more time? Hagla. How would I say I'm listening to it? I'm listening to it? Yeah. Hagla lead me to it. <laughs> um, I want to take out the sitting down part and just say Hagluli. Yeah, you could say that. Can you say it? Hagluli. One more time? Hagluli. And how about I'm listening to you? Chin Hagluli, I guess. Um, could you say that one more time? Chin Hagluli. I'm listening to you. Sahasha. <laughs> Sahasha. We'll do our best not to make you angry. <laughs> One more time. Sahasha. Okay. How would you tell her to stand up? Hika. One more time. Hika. Or that means stop, I know. Yeah. Okay. And once she stands up, she's already standing up. How would you say she's standing up? Hikia. One more time. Hikia. Hikia. 